Welcome dear friends to the Alien Connection series. So Alien Connection, what is it? Well, it's simple, it's a series of short videos that will explain to you who I am and what has happened to me in my life that is troubling. And that goes beyond the understanding in connection with extraterrestrials. So I'm going to tell you a few things about me through a few short video capsules. Fasten your seatbelt because it's a mind-blowing experience. Darling, I love it when you tell me things from your life that happened when you were young. Tell me the story you told me. When you went to the supermarket with your mom. Ah, uh, yes. I remember. I was young. I was about 10 years old, something like that, maybe younger. But what I remember is that we were in an alley in the supermarket. And suddenly, I had a drop in energy. You know, I was tired. And I felt that I was drained. So I said, well, I have to recharge myself, like a completely natural thing, you know, normal. So, I stopped in the aisle and put my hands like this. I closed my eyes. Boom. All the lights in the supermarket shut down. I knew it was me, you know, and my mother was in the aisle. And she said to me, Jean Charles, is that you? And I said, yes. She said, turn it back on right away. It's not funny. When the lights came back on, there was a guy standing next to us with his can of peas. He was like that. We didn't see that he was next to us because when the lights were shut off, he was completely frozen. My mother saw the guy. So she said to me, we're leaving, we're leaving quickly. How long it lasted? Oh, maybe two minutes, but enough for me to recharge. We arrive at the cash register. We go to the cash register. You have lights marked cash register 1, cash register 2, and it turns on it. And then suddenly, just the cash register, where we are turns off again. And there my mother says, stop doing that, it's not funny. But I'm young, so it is funny to me. So I look up and it flashes and it turns on again. The same guy in the other line, still frozen. My mother said, let's go, and we left. That was a little anecdote. When I'm tired like that, even now, I just have to look. A light source or whatever. And then it will fade, or it will shut down, or it will explode. I had a lot of interaction with electricity like that. When I was working in a nightclub, sometimes the lights would shut off. You told me, when you were young, that you used to play in your room to turn on your lamp with your mind. Or like in my room, I'd have fun turning the lights on and off. I was doing this from a distance. And later, when I was about 16 years old, I rented a video camera, a VHS video camera. And I filmed myself doing electrical things like that. I raised my hand and all of a sudden, the light was shut off. And in the film South Shore Origin, I put a piece of the footage, it was not a fake. And I am recognized, I was 16 years old on the video, you know. And I had, my dog in my arms. And at the moment, just before the light turned off, and on again. The dog's ears were raised. He had felt an energy. You know, how very receptive dogs are. I used to have a lot of fun with it. And even now, when I feel that I'm tired, it's like a kind of, when there's no electricity there. A generator? Yes, that's it. A generator starts up. It's like my generator. It's like I'm pumping the energy that's around me. So electricity. Yes, in electricity, not the energy of people especially not the energy of people. I remember, it happened when you went to the supermarket not so long ago. I think last year with the girls with one of my daughters. Yes. You know, you got to the checkout and...